The newly acquired piece of equipment, Malta radar equipment and a compact device will be used to ensure all speed guns produce accurate readings in Guyana. The equipment and training were procured from German company Genoptic by the Guyana National Bureau of Standards, GNBS, at a cost of 11 million. Following a two-day training with traffic ranks and representatives from GNBS, the device was tested at the South Dakota Circuit on the east bank of Demerara on Wednesday. In addition to ensuring safety along the roadways, Traffic Chief Superintendent Ramesh Ashram said with the verification of speed guns every six months, the Ghana Police Force will benefit from successfully prosecuting speeding drivers. The equipment that the Bureau has now acquired will enable us to have our speed guns, all of our speed guns, verified so it will better enable us as it relates to prosecution. That, was, that is one of the requirements, the speed guns and any equipment we use in the Guyana Police Force, whether breathalyzer, this tentometer, it has to be verified by the Bureau standard. And after that verification, the Bureau issue a certificate and they also will label it the speed guns. The two-day training was facilitated by Solutions Architect Manager of Genoptic, Carlan McDonald. According to him, the device is used in countries all over the world with high success rates. These systems, the Malta Radar Compact Device, which is being used as a control device by the National Bureau of Standards, has been deployed in conditions such as the fjords of Norway to the deserts of Oman. We have about 30,000 similar systems throughout the world, deployed in places such as Germany, Finland, Uruguay, Australia, Singapore, and the list goes on and on. Meanwhile, Director Acton of GNBS, Ramwati Karen, stated that the accuracy of measuring devices is critical and important, especially in the maintenance of law and order. And this move was followed by numerous complaints coming from um, stakeholders, drivers, and other persons in the public. Um, the intention of having or the service, the verification of the speed gun is to deliver accurate results um, and especially to drivers that are using the roadways. For the year thus far, 239 ranks were trained in the use of speed guns, breathalyzers, and tint meters. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Isanella Batwo.